morning tonight. If you're one of thousands in our area renting a home or apartment, an Oak Grove family says they had renter's insurance, but it wasn't enough to cover the long term expenses after a house fire. Investigative reporter Matt Fleener has a few tips to keep you safe. Six weeks have passed since a fire gutted part of this Oak Grove home. Every day I feel like I'm dreaming. Not going to lie. Like Air Force veteran Stefan Martin sees what's left of his family of six's yeah. rental home like, after know. food on their stove caught fire in April. It was smoke everywhere. Seven minutes of fire and smoke left soot on the walls, causing nearly $100,000 in damage. Martin says while he had renter's insurance, his family could have used more. Because you may think that you don't have a lot of stuff, but when it's all boiled down to it, <sighs> yeah, you, you lose a lot. We're in the people business. Lorianna King manages the rental home. Know. She knows Martin and his wife so and their four children are out people. of his home for months. As walls are repaired and the kitchen rebuilt, a one room hotel is getting them by until then. It is really hard when you see somebody going through this not to want to help. She's organized a GoFundMe for the family. She also says they've all learned the importance of more renters insurance than you think you need. I mean, just make sure that you would rather be over covered than under covered because you'll never regret that if something happens. You never know how quick things can just jump out of hand like that. Martin so says he's grateful for the support like so far, hoping to move back home like soon. The Kansas City Royals are also set to honor the family at an upcoming game and to thank Stefan for his service. In Oak Grove, Matt Fleener, KBC 9 News. If you would like to help this family of six during the next couple of months, Matt has shared the GoFundMe page on his KMBC Facebook page.